Hello scrappers and planet lovers, Tin Man here with another video. So an early Sunday morning doing another dumpster dive at this job site. You can see my truck is partially loaded, getting ready to go to the scrap yard with some odds and ends. Uh, I did actually start a dumpster a couple minutes ago. Unfortunately, I hit the slow motion button and it destroyed the video, so I had to start over. So I apologize, it seems like I'm always starting with boxes of Romex, but did get a really nice score from that dumpster. You can see some really nice glistening copper here. Copper continues to be our scrapper's gold. Unfortunately, all prices have gone down a little bit. But this wire, once cleaned, number two copper going right now for $4.67 a pound, Canadian, London, Ontario. So all of this I'm definitely going to strip. There is different gauges, a little bit of aluminum casing from some BX wire here. Um, so we'll put the final total of this uh, weight stripped uh, in my uh, comment section. There is a little tin roller there from the Romex. Tin has taken a tremendous hit. It was about 10 to 14 cents last week. Unfortunately, it has gone down to about uh, 8 cents a pound. But nevertheless, still better than nothing. So going to keep going with my scrapping here. I do have one dumpster here that I am going to look at just to see what uh, kind of stuff I have. Uh, I was here two weeks ago, found a little bit of Romex, which was great. Uh, but never know what else I'm going to find as time goes on, depending on the stage of the house. You can see there is, unfortunately, drywall material. The mudding is done, so nothing in here, unfortunately. But here we go. I actually just had an encounter with the builder here. I was standing out here, actually ran into a friend of mine. We got talking, and someone thought we were up to something suspicious. There has been a lot of theft lately and uh, people going through houses, so definitely do not want to be that person. Um, but uh, it's all good now. Um, he did see his friend walking down the street and he confirmed the story. So uh, just going to keep going here. Uh, again, you do want to make sure you ask permission at job sites to uh, go through the dumpsters. I have done that, which is great. But again, unfortunately, there are the few people that will uh, go in the houses taking tours or the theft problem definitely continues. So you know, make sure you're careful on that, asking permissions for sure. A lot of times the builders are more than gracious to allow you to take stuff if it's in the dumpster. They pay, unfortunately, to get these things removed. So the less items in there, the better for them. Uh, oh, unfortunately, this one too. Just a lot of carpeting. There has been a lot of flooding, a lot of uh, issues with carpeting. Not sure if uh, people throw these kind of things in there because of their um, basements flooded in the, the last torrential rain we got. Um, but, uh, you know, it is amazing what people will throw in here as well. Um, not sure if I'm going to find or what I'm going to find, but it has been a week and a half, so hopefully there'll be some things. I am actually amazed at how many people are actually working today. It is a Sunday. Uh, it is a beautiful day, but, uh, you know, maybe people are taking advantage of that. Got to get to my next bin here. Here is a good source of issue people have with theft. People will walk by, grab big spools of that 1S wire there, uh, and unfortunately, or they'll cut it and take it. So can't do that. But uh, looking inside here, oh, there is right there some tin. I'm gonna grab this tin, even though, look at that. So, a little bit of tin, gonna fill up this truck. Again, even at eight cents a pound, still better than nothing. You do have to be careful, it does get or can be sharp, but just gonna grab this, some tail ends on that side as well. They are, it looks like they are getting ready to put the electrical up, so hopefully, They'll be Romex wire soon, not sure, but uh, I'm hoping that it'll be thrown in the dumpster. Some of the electricians will take it. I do see a little bit inside there, but I'm not going in there. But uh, again, here are some little bit of tail end pieces of tin. It is, as you can see, pretty sharp edges there, but it all adds up. There's a little bit more. I'm gonna get that in a minute. See if I can reach in there. As you can see, look at all the water in there. 
from all of the rain. Another spool. I'll get that wheel. Pop can, about 80 cents a pound. I do have a load of these going in. So, just getting the tail end pieces. It all adds up. There we go. Throw it in the back of the truck. Especially if I am going to the scrap yard anyway, I want to make sure I maximize my load, get as much in there that I can. So as I said, look at those sharp edges on the side there. Got to be careful. Roofers working today up there. Don't want to disturb them. But uh, just going to keep going here. I can find look at all see look at all that rain there puddles mess oh, just gonna keep going on top roofing good friends constantly tell me when there is material ready to go not gonna mess with them they are on break but just gonna take a look at this dumpster they have given me lots of heads up when there is aluminum siding great company out of Corona but I'm uh, gonna look all right a little bit of you got a little bit of wire in here gonna see what I can get a little bit of tail end pieces again it all adds up little gauge look at the difference in gauge there you see some thicker stuff but all these little pieces here I'm gonna make sure I check there's some more Romex you can see little pieces like this. I get them all. If I can't fit them in my wire stripper, then I will at least just throw them into appliance wire. But you can see sometimes you'll get little pieces like this. There we go, depending on when the job site's done. A little bit of aluminum siding, look at that, or trim. This right here, hopefully I can grab it. There we go, aluminum trim. This stuff right here going for about 89 cents a pound. It's the same as your piece drop. Uh, fascia, soffits, uh, 89 cents. I just did a load, I had 160 pounds. Again, from the great people at On Top Roofing. Uh, so again, great work, but just gonna check another bin here. See what I have, oh, a little bit of siding, not much. A lot of garbage for sure. People do throw stuff in here. Uh, oh, the beer can there. See if I can reach that beer can. These I'm gonna make more money on the deposit. But uh, a lot of wood. Hopefully I will be coming back in a couple weeks and they will have more East Drop. So again, 89 cents a pound for this. Beer can, get the 10 cent deposit. All right, so all right. So far, so good. Again, gonna leave these guys be. Busy working on a Sunday, hard workers for sure. Great job. But just gonna drive right by. It's amazing how quickly some of these houses can be put up. Last, two weeks ago, this bin had a whole bunch of garbage in it. it had a stroller. It had, uh, a, uh, I think a dehumidifier vacuum cleaner so we'll see what else people are throwing in here oh I see different trim a lot of cardboard unfortunately some wood rails there we got anything oh there's a I thought I saw a beer can there it is at least a beer can 10 cents for that. Now well, it's all solid wood, balcony, banisters. So unfortunately, nothing of value. People are throwing their brass clippings in there, you could see, but uh, did get a ear can. So not sure how much more stuff I'm gonna find. I will do one more dumpster, see what else I can get last one which way do I want to go I'm gonna try 
Oh, let's go. Last one right here. That first one there, that is actually where I started. <laughs> so gonna just check this one, see if I have anything in this. Not sure, but. All right, let's take a look and see. There's a piece of a shovel. All right, well, I'll take that because this is a nice piece of tin. Again, it would be steel. There's another pop can, but not gonna mosey or rummage through that, a lot of garbage. But uh, just gonna end it there, I think. Short, short video, do have to wrap up. Again, there are a lot of people out and about, so I don't want to arouse too much suspicion. But again, just in this little 10 minute video, some nice tin, some nice aluminum siding there or uh, trim that's gonna go into the aluminum siding at 89 cents a pound. Tin again, about uh, eight cents a pound uh, to 10 cents a pound, depending on where you are. Some beautiful copper, number one or bare bright copper, a couple beer cans, pop cans in there, a nice tin roller and some more items diverted from the landfill. So hope you enjoyed that again. Uh, hopefully fulfilling the promise of more dumpster dives while I have the time off. School is beginning in a couple weeks, so won't have as much time to do that. But right now, getting it while the going is good and when I have the time. So again, hope you enjoyed that. Please comment down below, like, share, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Tin Man out.